Hello subscribers and my dear students. How are you? I think you are fine and uh, today I am again back with an interesting video. Hope you like it. Kindly subscribe my channel. So let's start it. Hello dear students. Today I am back with another video. Our topic of discussion today is about profit and loss account. Now what is profit and loss account? This is an account which shows a company revenue and expenses over a particular period of time okay profit and loss account may be again say it is your total income and expenses which shows whether your business has earned more income than spent on its running costs okay profit profit and loss account profit and loss account represents the profitability of the business yes now let us discuss the features features of profit and loss account when you say about the features first of all it is prepared on the last day of an accounting year okay why on the last day to ascertain the net result of the business okay second it is the second stage of final accounts after trading account yes third indirect expenses and <coughs> indirect revenue are shown in this profit and loss account the most important one it starts with closing balance of trading account remember in the last video i told the net profit or the or the gross and loss is transferred to profit and loss account so it starts with the closing balance then all items of revenue concerning current year okay whether whether cash received or not yes will be taken into this profit and loss account clear now let us discuss about another point which is also the objective 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 is that to ascertain whether to ascertain whether the business is making profit or loss for the given period okay 
Another objective is to whether profit and loss account or profit and loss account reveals money spent or cost incurred in an organization efforts to generate revenue oblique representing the cost of business cost of doing business okay business these are the two main objectives of profit and loss account now let us have a difference between trading account and profit and loss account here i write as trading account and here i write it profit and loss account let us write the differences number one if we go by meaning yes trading and profit trading account is used to find the gross profit oblique loss of the business during a financial or accounting year yes in the same way find net profit oblique loss of the business in any financial year or accounting year then timing trading account is prepared first okay then profit and loss account clear so here what will be profit and loss account is prepared after after trading account okay then purpose is to know the gross profit oblique gross loss of the of the business okay same is the case to know about the net profit oblique net loss of the business okay dependency 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 it is not dependent on trial balance yes it is dependent on trading account clear then transfer of balance the transfer trading account transfer balance to profit and loss account profit and loss account transfer balance to balance sheet clear now let us prepare one format let us prepare one format format of profit and loss account yes here it is particulars amount particulars amount okay now first of all if we have loss in trading account then we start here with gross loss brought down and if we have in the trading account profit then we can write gross profit 
that is again brought down then we can write all type of selling expense selling and distribution expenses here relating to business then we can write all the management expenses yes then we can uh, write all the financial expenses okay then we can uh, write all the abnormal abnormal losses yes here we will write other incomes any incomes received by the company such as discount received commission received yes then by abnormal abnormal gains abnormal gains means uh, profit from sale of machinery or something sale of investment yes if the debit side if the credit side this is this the, sorry if the credit side is higher than the debit side then we get to net profit transfer net profit transfer to capital account or if the debit side is higher and the credit side is less or less then we get net loss transfer to capital account okay selling and distribution expenses include advertisement export expense expenses carriage outward management expenses include rent rates office salaries printing stationaries yes then financial expenses include discount allowed interest on bill then abnormal losses mean loss by fire yes here other income means discount receive commission receive like that okay so this is the format of our profit and loss account so we have discussed today about profit and loss account yes then we discussed about the features of profit and loss account then we have discussed the objective for profit and loss account yes we have created one differences between profit and loss account on the basis of these um, parameters yes finally we have given the format of profit and loss account hope you like my video kindly subscribe my channel and please press the bell icon so that you get an extra bit thank you for watching